An hour after birth, my partner announced he was dumping me. When I returned home, Ron threw my things out. He said he'd changed the locks already and I had to go. In a window, I saw him kiss some blonde. I was all alone in the city. My baby and I slept in a shelter. Next day, my daughter looked weak and wouldn't eat. I went to the hospital and bumped into Ron. With my stroller, I rushed to it, but Ron pushed me away. He said it was for his son. Doc had bad news. My daughter had diabetes. He said the illness was passed down from the mother. I demanded a retest. I'd never had diabetes. Doc agreed and jokingly suggested I take a DNA test as well. As he walked out, a nurse suddenly fainted. I brought her to senses and she burst into tears. She said Ron made her do this, threatening to get her husband arrested. He was an accountant in Ron's firm and Ron accused him of fraud. Ron told the nurse to switch babies or he'd destroy her husband. She gave me another woman's baby and my son to someone else. That's why the girl had diabetes and I didn't. I went to Ron's, but a stranger opened the door. The house was sold. I dialed Ron's secretary and she gave me his new address. With baby in arms, I arrived at a fancy mansion. In the yard, I saw that blonde with my son. I rushed over, demanding my son back. Ron pushed me away and called me crazy. He threatened to call the cops if I didn't leave. But it was too late. The police already arrived. I called them. Just then, I got a text that returned my son to me. The test results were in. I showed it to Ron's lover. A few days later, Tanya and I were having coffee. We got to the bottom of it. Ron wanted to merge with her firm and he wanted a son. So he decided to kill two birds with one stone. He took my boy and stayed with his rich lover. But Ron paid for it in full. The scoundrel got jail time. Tanya and I swapped our kids back and things went back to normal. Her girl is getting treatment and doing well. Tanya helped me find a job. I'm an office manager in her firm now. A baby switched at birth is any mom's greatest fear, isn't it? <laughs>